Hi, my name is Lauren Johnson and I'm one of the product solution specialists for Avin here at NAM 2020. Uh, I'm showing at this booth the Matrix Studio. So basically it's the baby version of our Matrix. Uh, whereas you used to have to buy the box and buy cards to pretty much pre-configure to configure it, now it comes pre-configured. So we have 16, sorry, 18 channels of analog in, 22 analog out, 16 by 16 ADAT, 64 channels of Dante, and 64 channels of DigiLake. So if you come over here and kind of take a look at the box, we've got some pretty cool stuff going on. So if I'm on my in, my inputs here, and then I use this little button to toggle, my blue is going to, the first blue you saw is going to show me my analog. The second one is going to be my ADAT. And then the third is going to be my Dante in orange. So you can see that I'm channel one of Dante and channel one through 16 by the fact that the little one is white. If I go to channel two, you'll see that I'm on now channel 17 and so on and so forth. So I can get through all 64 channels of Dante on the front of the box. Um, same thing with my outs, same color coding system is going to follow suit. And then uh, we actually have some built-in mic pre's too. We've got two built-in mic line. So if I switch over here to the pre button, you'll see that light screen and green is gonna correspond to my mic. Uh, if I press the input button, that's actually gonna switch over to instrument. So I'll be able to, and that's actually gonna be these two ports right here. So I'll be able to toggle back and forth between those. But if I go back to mic, the cool thing is now, if I go over to these ABC buttons, a is going to turn on and off linking. So if I'm doing any stereo miking or just, you know, maybe a boom in a, a lavalier or something. Um, so I'll turn that off. Then I go over here to B. B is going to be my phase. And then C is going to be my 48 volts. So I have full control of the box straight from the front of the unit. I don't need to pop into the software to do it. And then to just get out of that menu, all I have to do is press pre again and we're back. So if we come over here, you'll see there's a little headphone, a little speaker icon, or yeah, excuse me, speaker and a headphone icon. So the speakers are obviously going to be for my, my sources, and then the headphones are going to be whatever I've got going through my cues. So I've got the ability here to go through four different layers of control room. So I have one, two, three, and four, and those are going to change by color. So two is purple. Three is going to be this sort of pink, and four is going to be this like peachy pink color. And you can see that the headphones, or the excuse me, the outputs are active by the speakers. So if I press the encoder in, that's kind of hard to tell here, but that's going to turn red. We'll do that on the first layer. So you can see that one is now muted because it's red. So if I press the encoder again, that comes off. Uh, and then if I go into my headphones here, We've got two, uh, there's four Q layers, but I've got two active right now, so I can toggle back and forth between those with one and two. And then I can kind of just change whatever I've programmed into Dadman. So it can be other information besides sources, but this is a great way to kind of be able to control the box uh, as you see fit. And uh, we're asking, or we're, uh, we're advertising it for $4,999. So come on down to the booth, check it out, and say hey.